It's Thursday, March 3rd, tonight on eTalk Daily. Why is Michael Buble making beautiful music with Nelly Furtado? He gives us a lowdown. Then is Canadian cutie Ryan Reynolds getting a little too comfy in the U.S.? We're on his Canadian set for all the details. You know, the, the coldest place on planet Earth. And Hilary Swank owes her million dollar look to a Canadian, and he spills all her fitness secrets. Woo! Oh my God. Plus, it's make or break day here in Winnipeg, and only we can take you inside the Idol audition room. All this and more on eTalk Daily, your number one source for everything entertainment. Now we know that Oscar was in Hillary Swank's corner, but so was a Canadian trainer who bulked up the big screen beauty. Our Anna Sizon stepped into the ring with Grant Roberts. All laced up, ready to fight. He put the muscle in Hillary's golden punch and helped Million Dollar Baby knock out the Oscar competition. My trainers, Grant Roberts and Hector Roca, you pushed me further than I ever thought I could push myself up to that last pound, actually to that last ounce. Pitt Meadow BC's Grant Roberts is the man behind Hillary Swank's bulging biceps. Right after she saw the screening for the first time, uh, as she was walking out, she called me and just it was so complimentary. She said things like I'd made the film credible and she was just thrilled with the way she looked and it was perfect and, you know, she's just very genuine. When clients come to you, how do you decide to take on a client? Like, is there certain physical, psychological factors that you consider? Um, in Hillary's case, absolutely. Um, because there was only nine weeks left and it was such a momentous task to, mm -hmm. um, to have her in the ring with the actual 140-pound champion of the world who's who's the girl that plays opposite her in the movie. Mm -hmm. At the time, Hillary was 110 pounds, and that's a very tall order. So if she wasn't committed to this project, there was no way I was doing it. And Clint probably called me about five times that day and uh, you know, what, asked me what I thought and where it was going. I said, you know, I'll, I'll take you to the gym tonight and I'll call you in the morning. And um, that night she convinced me she was on board. Wow, so she was a trooper. Absolutely. Now I heard you had her pushing SUVs through the parking yeah. lot after. Yeah. Where, where do you get these uh, crazy working hours? Um, that's ideas. the whole key to growth. I mean, she had to put on a lot of size and, and quickly. And, and the way to do that is to continually shock the system. Mm -hmm. uh, so pushing an SUV is one way to do that. I trained her in a pool, uh, gave her some really unique workouts. And, uh, you know, she gained on average a little more than two pounds a week, which you can't do any better. That's that's as good as it can. I need to do some chin-ups, too, because yeah. I can't even do one. That's, that's where Hillary started. <laughs> Hillary could do half chin-up on the first day, and nine weeks later, she could do ten. For those of you at home who don't have weights, you can substitute with soup cans, Coke bottles, or people. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh, my God.